asked ChatGPT to give me 10 weird gaming challenge ideas, and this is what came back. Oh boy, we got some great things in this video. Tinfoil hat challenge, retro pixel vision, tongue-tied gaming, reverse reality. Things are going to be real weird in this video. But first up, we have the tinfoil hat communication challenge. Communicate with your online teammates using a tinfoil hat with an attached microphone. I'm asking ChatGPT to pick me a game as well. So the odds that it actually is a game that supports voice chat is very low, I'll say that. Zelda, A Link Between Worlds. I'm gonna be playing with this thing on. You have to take the headphones off. Will I actually mess up my headphones? It's working, baby. Give me my tinfoil hat. It's like a glove. There's a microphone on top. Yeah, that's definitely a microphone. Nice, <laughs> You outdid yourself this time. This is this is the hardest challenge I've ever had to do. Man, I have never had to do such a hard challenge, ChatGPT. Man, chill out, man. Chill out, bro. <laughs> the hardest part was making the tinfoil hat. So what, do I have to beat the whole game? <laughs> With the tinfoil hat? Play it for as long as you want to play it. I guess, yeah. Yeah, ChatGPT, you, you wanted this, huh? I did. High school kid sits in his room playing on his DS with this on his head. At least you have protection. Oh, I probably need the wind rod for this. With the tornado rod or whatever. Now you're protected from aliens controlling you. Next challenge. Alright, our next gaming challenge from ChatGPT is the Retro Pixel Vision Challenge. We gotta apply a pixelated filter to the entire screen on a modern game. So, um, I'm going to ask ChatGPT to pick another one, but make it a modern game. Red Dead Redemption Game of the Year Edition. Okay. We're going to be playing Red Dead Redemption, but it's more like Red Dead Pixelation. Alright, so apparently to this game I have to add a pixel filter. Uh, and the only way I can think of doing that is with an OBS filter, so let's do that. Now, if you could go turn off the TV, please, uh, and make this as authentic as possible. So I press X for single player, and... Let's see how Did this goes. I could try, yes. Oh, that looks like Japanese. The license information looks like Japanese. Something could be really wrong with my PS3 and I don't know. Oh, okay, we have the we have the gunshot thing. Actually, let me put, turn the audio on coming out of my headphones so I can hear it. Never takes this long to load. Oh, I hear some not good things coming for my PlayStation. Oh, I think I think we're in the game. I see I see my guy. Honestly, this isn't as bad as it like looks, 
but it's still pretty bad. I can, like, see my character, and I can see the world, but I can't see any of the finer details. Top and bottom are just entirely done for, so it looks like I'm playing through a tunnel vision as well as playing in this pixelated view. I cannot see any UI elements either. Those would have been interesting to see. This looks like what I would imagine it looks like from your perspective when you take mushrooms. Alright, so our next ChatGPT challenge is the Puppet Master Challenge, where you have to attach strings or wires to your fingers and manipulate them like puppet strings. So, uh, Sammy's got some string, and she's gonna put it on my fingers. Sonic Generations for PS3. Alright, cool. It is loading. Sammy now has four fingers to control, so you have to get me over to the X button to press continue. And you have to pull it down, so I press it. It's like I'm limp. <laughs> now you have to pull it up. No, that's da wrong. No! That's down! Pull it up! Well, okay, okay, we're, we're entering a level. <laughs> oh, now you have to press X. Uh, I actually... Get all four ready. This is gonna be some high-octane gameplay. <laughs> it's like I'm sleeping, and you're, like, moving my finger Dude, around. What I was sleeping, I didn't see anything. Bro. No. Oh, you got a red star ring. That's cool. But this does kind of hurt my my right analog thumb. You're pulling me the wrong way. That's your fault, Sammy. I know. I know. You actually pulled it past the X button and on to select. Okay, I'm done with this. Get this off my finger. Oh no, it's not another. It's another. It's another one. Tongue tied gaming challenge. Tape a small object to your tongue and attempt to play a game. And that small object is going to have to be the control pad or stick of whatever I use. This is gonna be very gross. Turn away! I don't blame you for clicking off right now to figure out what game it's going to be in. Mario Kart Wii Wii. Oh, jeez. Has anybody tried to play Mario Kart Wii with their tongue? Actually, Sammy, can you put the tinfoil on the nunchuck itself and then I'll just lick that? Oh, yeah, that's actually a better idea. Actually, put some on the, on the Z and the C as well. And do this very... Grotesque challenge. Actually, Sammy, hold up. I have an idea. You be cameraman for this. All right. Since no real camera angle is gonna work for this. All right. Oh wait, I have to put this back on. Okay. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> 
<laughs> you have to move the ninja too. You press V. I'll hold it with my hand and I'll use my... <laughs> You're actually going... <laughs> <laughs> Great quality content right here. Is the worst part is he can't even commentate. I have to like twist it and then accelerate. <laughs> that is so great. Right. <laughs> like this is a much better idea. You look like you're trying to enjoy two foods at the same time. <laughs> yeah, the foods of moving and turning. <laughs> Oh wow! <laughs> you Imagine... have to say I'm not getting a new time trial record. Imagine you do. <laughs> Is this what you wanted, ChatGPT? You're welcome. Oh, oh, oh. welcome. <laughs> He's actually doing. It. Oh. <laughs> I just take the remote. Oh, why not? Okay, okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boost that, boost that. Go! This is so stupid, bro. <laughs> oh, I'm not one. Go! <laughs> I mean, that's it. Someone, someone watching us is probably wondering what you're doing. Not on YouTube, but like watching the game footage. What are you doing? You suck. Oh, the rumble felt so weird in my mouth. <laughs> the rumble! <laughs> Turn. Go. You're lined up for the booster pads. Ugh. Go. He's just torturing us. Ugh. Oh, look at the car. Ah! Ah! Wait, um, what would happen if she flew into the crowd? <laughs> I'm licking a wheel out. All right, turn. You gotta turn. He already finished the race. I'm on lap two. All the people with like foot finishes are gonna be absorbing this. <laughs> I just zoomed in on your mouth. Oh, that's just gross. Don't do that. <laughs> this is sh definitely a challenge. A challenge to watch, maybe. Seems like a challenge for you, too. <laughs> it is. It's just gonna grind down your tongue. Oh, my, my jaw hurts so much too. My <laughs> jaw. Yeah, it's been four minutes of you licking your controller. Oh. Oh, you're doing good. Turn. Yeah, go. Hit those booster pads. Go. Oh, yeah. Oh, stay strong, pretty strong. <laughs> okay, 449961. Oh. The next ChatGPT challenge is the Invisible Opponents Challenge. I have to, um... I have to convince myself that my opponents are invisible. Whoa, Super Mario Galaxy! What a great game! How polished, how nice. I still don't know. How am I gonna forget? Whoa. You all right? I got knocked out or something. Why are we playing this game? What could. What, what was it picked by ChatGPT or something?
Let's go to Bowser Star Reactor. Man, reactors are so cool, bro. And stars are really cool. <coughs> oh, this is gonna be insane. Okay, let's just take a nice little stroll here. Oh, whoa, I almost fell off the edge. That's crazy. Okay, let's go back to the beginning. Let's, let's, let's just walk back. What? I walked into nothing, and I get hurt! Nintendo! Nintendo, fix your game! Nintendo, look, 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 look what happened, Shigeru Miyamoto. I walk forward, and I get hit by nothing! There is nothing there! You can't tell me there is nothing right there! It's literally just some carpet and some rocks, dude! Oh, things are getting weird! What?! Oh, it's another one of those weird bugs! Come on! Please! What- What is even- Bro! Okay. Hey, one more try, one more try, one more try. Oh my gosh, dude! Mm -hmm. Nintendo! Mario, stop getting hit, you dumb piece of work! What? I just speed jumped! Excuse me! Mario, bro! Mario is a walking liability! Too bad! What's too bad? I didn't- I just walked that whole time, bro! Nowadays, is it freaking Nintendo of America? What? Too bad! Well, how is it that when I walk forward, I just instantly die? Oh, screw this game! Alright, what if we go backwards? Surely going backwards can't. I went backwards, and it hurt me! <laughs> Nintendo! Fix your game! Alright, if we keep going backwards, it surely won't- WHAT?! TOO BAD?! YOU'RE TOO BAD, NINTENDO! COME ON! Walked and jumped! What is the problem here? Oh, it's a nice, like, tropical island thing. Who are you? <coughs> Let's head down to the. I tried to ground pound in the water, and this is what it gives me? Please, Nintendo, please! Nah, let's check down here. What? I died! But I was just heading up to the surface! This game sucks! Gah! Oh, oh, I hit my head. Damn it. I'm playing Galaxy? Oh, for that challenge? How are we even gonna do that? You, you already did. Oh! Well, anyway, time for our next gaming challenge! Need for Speed Underground for GameCube. You need to introduce the challenge first. <clears throat> and the challenge we're going to be doing with this game is... Fishbowl Vision Challenge. So I need to go get a fishbowl. We don't have a fishbowl, but I think these are going to be hard enough. I can hold them while you play. Yeah, hold on. Alright, really quickly before we start the challenge, I would just like to say, if you're not subscribed already, please make sure to subscribe. It helps out a lot. Okay, so I said something really funny here, but there was copyrighted music, so uh, I had to cut it. Uh... Oh. Menus are my worst enemy in these. Can you even read it? 
Barely. I can read that it says auto and manual. Uh, number of laps and the rest of it I can't really read. Hold it. Move them. However. Oh. oh, that just feels. Oh, 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 that feels weird. Move them to your one. I moved them off my face. Oh, I think the way, way to make it more fun is to have a weird side. What button? Am I moving? Oh, I'm moving. <laughs> Need to record some people. Yeah. <laughs> I can I can see a little bit out of the edge of my eye. Uh, it's like I have double vision on those. <laughs> so this is what LSD feels like. I'm coming out. Oh. The worst thing is your hands on my shoulders. Oh. Yeah, there we go. Oh, oh boy, oh. Oh, I can, I can see a little bit through the back. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna put some B-roll of what I see. <coughs> I might throw up. <laughs> so this is what drunk driving feels like. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh, if I move them this way, I can... If you I can that, then you need to take Oh, I can, I can actually see what I'm doing from this angle. Okay, now we're just playing some normal need for speed. Okay, I forgot to record it, but uh, the next challenge is I have to tape my fingers together and play that way, which is pretty bad because I ended up getting Grand Ages Rome, a PC game, as the game I have to do this in. Meaning I have to use my whole keyboard with just basically two fingers. I basically just have a flat... I can kind of click the mouse. I can, I can, I can't really write, I can't really middle click, but I, I doubt I'll need to do that. Alright, let's go with a male family and let's call it... That. Uh, how do I... Okay. How do I... How do I... Female? Male? Oh, I have to click one of these dudes. Uh, let's let's go. I gotta go 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 chopstick mode. Uh, let's do this dude. He looks cool. He looks like the. the Sammy, he pop my headphones like, on me. He I want like to hear the. From, I want to hear the audio. He looks like the guy from the last Airbender. The mouse is going to be fine. I think I could use the mouse fine. But the keyboard is going to be an issue. So we go for... How do I even play this game? My exile into Africa is close to an end. Our family has suffered much under the tyrannical fist of Sula. Now that the dictator is gone, I will finally be able to... We Romans are the greatest force in Hey guys, my, my fingers hurt. The worst way to play Grand Age is Rome. Stuck together. At least one nearby building is needed. Well, I don't have any building! Oh, are these things buildings over here? 
Okay, I guess I guess this is a building. What should we make? Let's make an insula. It's being built. All right, we built one building, and that's enough. I'm breaking free from these chains. Like breaking free from slavery. All right, that was Grand Ages Rome, but my hands are all tied together. That was uh, pretty bad. But our next gaming challenge is even worse. Reverse reality challenge. We have to set the screen to negative colors and play a game in this reversed reality. Let's play a little bit of this game. And I have an idea. Look at this. Visual filter inverted. So it doesn't look too bad right now. But wait till we get to the actual game. See, that doesn't look too bad. But then... <laughs> Dark black? Mm-hmm. That looks very weird. It looks very king's. <laughs> oh, look at him! This isn't so much a challenge, more so an eyesore. Okay, my phone died, so we're just gonna do this no webcam style. Oh, now this looks... Weird! Oh, look at that! This looks so odd! Use the D-pad, that works. We have conquered eight brutal challenges. There are only two more to go. Is the Tea Party Controller Swap Challenge. I have to host a mini tea party while playing a cooperative game and every few minutes swap controllers with someone else at the tea party. Sammy, do you know how to make a tea party? I do. Two players. Oh, so we're just gonna swap each other's controllers? Yeah. Okay, that actually kind of sounds pretty interesting. I got some fresh Quotan Quotes tea. You can plug in one of my GameCube controllers to use. Do you not have two Wii controllers? Yeah, I do, but playing with the Wii remotes. Just to let you know, we didn't have to speak in British accents for this challenge. Sammy just wanted to, and I went along with it. Alright. Alright, mate. I need a controller. You want to start the GameCube controller, and I'll start with the Wii Classic Controller. Sure. Classic you know it Controller. Doesn't, you know it doesn't really matter. We gotta fight them!
my breaker, mate. How dare you steal my trumpets? I said I did it. I literally saw you steal my trumpets. <laughs> Hey, from the back! We need to switch, bro. Wait, we switching? Oh, I'm losing now! Why don't Americans have their tea pies? Oh, my... What? How do you finish him? Oh, it's just that simple, mate. All right, this last challenge is pretty interesting. So, I had ChatGPT simulate an average Chinese kid that is working in a factory producing fortune cookies to give me some of the things they were to write on a fortune cookie in character. And my sister is going to read them out. Harmony blossoms when the lotus of patience meets the river of opportunity. Navigate life's maze like a link through time with courage as your compass and wisdom as your guide. In the melody of existence, let courage be your tempo and compassion your song. Like the kokiri in the forest, grow strong roots of resilience, for storms may come but they shall pass. Unlock the doors of destiny with keys forged from perseverance and adorned with the tools of kindness. In the quest of life, wield the master sword of purpose, shielded by the wisdom of your choices. As the hero of time faces trials, embrace challenges with a heart that echoes courage and spirit attuned to the harmony of balance. Amidst the echoes of the temple of time, forge your own path, guided by the triforce of dreams, determination, and compassion. Like a diligent cookery, tending to the great Deku tree, nurture your dreams with dedication, for every step echoes the journey of a free spirit. In the labyrinth of life, navigate with resilience and hope. For even in the echo of constrained wings, the heart yearns for freedom's song. Now back to work, Lil! Alright, see ya.